I was thinking, uh, I was trying to see if it would blow, uh, if this little thing would spin out there in the wind. And as I start walking back to my house, I notice the uh, window AC unit I have. Uh, even though I run the AC all day, I might as well recycle the air that comes out of the back of the, the AC unit. So I put this fan here. And uh, as you can see, it's blowing quite well just from the exhaust of the hot air from the AC. So if I set up the, uh, so far back I get up wrong. That's about, that's about a foot right there. I have a big gust of wind blowing behind me. But that's about a foot right there from the AC unit. And I'm recycling the hot air. So I'll put it down at this angle. Off the AC unit. Hot air rises and this is hot air blowing out of here. Raise it up a little bit higher. Oh, right there is perfect. And uh, I can stick a little wind jenner right here just behind my AC unit and uh, make free energy just off of the energy that uh, this is blowing out of the AC unit. And uh, I run this 24 hours a day. Uh, so I would be generating even at nighttime if it was if the wind wasn't blowing. But right here at night the wind blows really hard. I have in my hand I have a plug. And I was thinking, well if the wind can blow that little fan out of that microwave, what other fan could it blow? So I went inside and got my oscillating fan and this is the plug. It goes to my ice oscillating fan and it's unplugged as you can see. And it's spinning just from the wind outside. And as it spins, it's oscillating. It's moving left and right wherever the wind is coming from. See how fast it's blowing? I do not have that plugged in at all. As you can see, there's no wires going around it. And it's oscillating. This, it's funny. This fan is following the air. And it's blowing pretty good. So I don't know how much, uh, uh, oscillating fan would uh, put out how much energy would put out by just by spinning and as you can see I'm underneath my carport uh, they're just when it's windy out it's, just, it's like a tunnel right here on my front porch the wind just blows through here uh, pretty good it's just you know I'm standing in front of the thing now but uh, yeah, it follows the wind wherever the wind is. So I was thinking, oh, if the wind could blow it, uh, if that my AC unit could blow the little fan, well, it'd blow this fan. And uh, as you can see, there it goes. It's blowing this fan too. So if I was to somehow make this. Uh, oscillating fan into a generator because I run this AC unit all the time the wind coming off this uh, AC unit is turning this fan and because this fan is open area it wouldn't block the uh, output of the AC blowing out so the AC wouldn't overheat uh, let me set this down again over here the wind's blowing pretty good there we go getting a pretty big gust of wind it's uh, oscillating. And like I said, it's, it's not plugged in. And it's always windy here in my house, always. Always during the day. Uh, let me lock this. Just see how that, how that does. I don't have anything to measure how fast it's spinning, but it looks like it's about on medium speed. Oh, I'm not slowing down. That locked and oscillating. So let me let me unlock it. See what happens. There it goes again, following the wind. Huh, this is funny. I never thought of this before. I'm just it came to me. So you know, somebody else was thinking how they could make a wind generator without spending a lot of money. Go to Walmart, pick up this fan. I think I spend uh, 
10 bucks on this fan at Walmart. Uh, hook it up to uh, some battery and see if it'll charge a battery or ohm meter or something, whatever. I don't have anything like that. But like I said, it's unplugged and it's working. Yeah.